Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, welcome in. My name is Callie Luis. I know you guys saw the thumbnail. You guys are probably thinking, Luis, you just put Pee Wee's Playhouse plush, right? Yep, exactly. I actually got this plush uh, maybe like two or three weeks ago, per se. And unfortunately, Paul Rubens, better known as Pee Wee Herman, did pass away. So now that he is no longer with us, all his items are very collectible and people are trying to get any of these items for their collections, you know, for their personals to resell for whatever reason. So hang out with me. I'm, I'm going to show you guys what this plush sold for and how much I got it for. And like I said, it's a sad situation, but I'm going to show you guys how sometimes death of a celebrity or a, or just someone that's in the on Hollywood makes a big difference with items the way they sell. So let's definitely sit back, relax. If you're drinking some coffee, drink your coffee. If you're drinking some water, make sure you chug some water. Or if it's uh, 5 o'clock wherever you're at, pop open a beer, drink a cold one. Let's get this video started. Welcome back everyone. So we're going to go ahead and jump into this video. I'm going to show you show you what I sold and pretty much the star of this video is Mr. Pee Wee Herman. May he rest in peace. This is a Pee Wee Herman uh, Pee Wee's Playhouse plush. This is 18 inches long. It has the posable, the, hand, the arms and the legs. You pretty much stand them up or set them up however you want. I got this on an online auction. I paid $10 for this. And like I said, uh, I wasn't expecting the unfortunate passing of Paul Rubens, but unfortunately he did pass away. So I did have this listed and pretty much anything that had to do with Pee Wee Herman or Paul Rubens skyrocketed in price. So he is in used condition. There you could see some of the Paint missing on top of his hair. Some blemishes here and there. Some scratches. The audio, when you pull the string, it's a little fast. See? So I have to hold it and slow it down. See, if you slow it down, you can hear it. But like I said, the talk box does need to be repaired. So uh, I did list this uh, plush on eBay and also on Poshmark. So let me show you guys what Mr. Pee Wee Herman sold for. Definitely uh, wasn't expecting it to sell for this much, but it did sell. Like I said, unfortunately, when anytime a celebrity or anyone that's in Hollywood does pass away, their items do go up in value. And this is just another example of that happening. And some people say, well, you know, you're exploiting the dead. You're exploiting someone that just passed away. Believe me, Pee Wee Herman was a part of my childhood, too. I grew up in the 70s. I was born in the late 70s, grew up in the early 80s. So Pee Wee's Playhouse was one of my favorite shows to watch on Saturday mornings. So he was a big part of my childhood. So, yeah, it, it was a sad shit situation. And it was sad to hear about Pee Wee uh, Paul Rubens passing away. But like I said, when it comes down to it, I'm a reseller. So I'm definitely, like I said, I'm going to put this up there and uh, get it sold, which it did. So definitely uh, going to ship this out. I sold this on Poshmark. So definitely uh, was great that I'm getting some sales on Poshmark. But anything that's related with Pee Wee, Pee Wee's Playhouse, even his DVDs, anything that has to do with Pee Wee's Big Adventure, Big Top Pee Wee. You know, just any stuff that he has to do with uh, Pee Wee Herman will definitely be a collector. A lot of people don't even know that Paul Rubens uh, came out on the Cheech and Chong movie. That's why I'm wearing the Cheech and Chong shirt. He came out in one of those movies. So he's he came out in a couple of movies here and there. And uh, like I said, he did act and uh, he did. He was a great, like I said, but it will never uh, top uh, him being my, like, one of my childhood favorites uh, watching Pee Wee's Playhouse uh, when I was a kid. And of course, later on, as we got older, we got introduced to the movies and to, you know, everything else that he was doing. Comedic genius, in my opinion. Uh, he knew uh, 
how to just uh, make goofiness and silliness be normal. So definitely uh, a good sense of humor that he had. And he was a great talent that unfortunately we no longer have. But we will have all his memories and everything uh, that he actually made with his shows, his plays and movies, of course, that will always be there to keep his uh, memory alive and legacy. But yeah, I definitely just wanted to share this with you guys and show you guys what sold uh, when I know you guys are probably thinking like, man, what is he talking about? But definitely uh, makes me yeah, it makes me laugh just thinking about the <laughs> some of the dumb stuff he used to do and uh, stupid, silly stuff, which uh, still makes me laugh just thinking about it. Um, uh, it was the uh, last movie I think I saw of his was Pee Wee's Big Holiday or Holiday Adventure. I think it was on Netflix, but. There's a scene in that movie. Uh, I'm not going to spoil it if you guys haven't seen it, but it's very funny. So uh, I was just thinking about the the way he reacted <laughs> when he saw something. I don't want to say it because if you haven't seen it, I don't want to spoil it for you. But I'm going to show you guys a quick clip real quick of what I'm talking about. <laughs> it makes you just laugh. Yeah, man. Uh, I always got a good laugh watching uh, Pee Wee's movies and... Uh, Definitely, uh, if you guys are uh, out there sourcing, be on the lookout for anything Pee Wee Herman related or anything with Pee Wee's Playhouse or any of his movies. Everything right now is uh, I've been looking at uh, some of the stuff online and uh, some of the stuff has been selling for more and it's been bumping up his autograph pictures, his autographs, uh, plush, anything that has to do with uh, the show Pee Wee's Playhouse, uh, any of the characters and all that stuff. Uh, so definitely keep an eye out for that. And uh, like I said, unfortunate, you know, that he's no longer with us. But like I said, you know, I'm a reseller when it comes down to it. Um, it, it's, it sucks that he is no longer here. Uh, part of my childhood, of course, like I said. So I'm always going to remember uh, Paul Rubin, Pee Wee Herman. So uh, may he rest in peace. And uh, thank you guys for watching this video. I just wanted to show you guys what is going on right now with anything Pee Wee Herman or Paul Rubin related. So definitely, if you guys enjoy this, hit the thumbs up for me. I always appreciate all the support. Thank you guys for always watching. And uh, to all you new uh, subscribers, welcome in. Feel free to drop any comments down below. Anything uh, you guys want to know or see. And uh, like, like I said, I like posting these kind of videos for you. Uh, just a little different. Show a little bit of my personality and show a little bit of what I'm about. You know, like I said, I have a whole rack full of stuff out back there. You know, the stuff that is for my personality, for my growing up. So, you know, it comes down to it. I'm still a big kid at heart. And uh, like I said, you only feel as young as you feel. So that's just by my model. So thank you guys, uh, like I said, for joining me today. Appreciate it. Hit the thumbs up for me. And like I said, follow me on all my social media, Cali Luis. Uh, follow me on TikTok, Cali Luis 909. Instagram, Cali Luis 909. And like I said, follow me here on YouTube. And I will keep posting up some more content for you guys. So thank you guys for rocking with me today. Appreciate it. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace. And chicken grease. And of course, rest in peace to Paul Rubens, also known as Pee Wee Herman.